Well, James and Emma, you have known each other for quite some time, in fact, about 10 years. However, it was on a walking holiday here in Scotland in February when you were both looking for a hotel to spend the night that you stumbled upon this place, from Tochty Castle. With it being Valentine's weekend, James, being true to his name, wanted a very special place to stay. And he contacted the castle, but he was told it was purely a wedding venue. Being the spontaneous couple that you are, you followed your instincts. And after a visit to the castle the next day, you were sold on that being the venue for your wedding, and you set the date. So, firstly, and most importantly, the bride. I think you will all agree, she, she is the luckiest woman in the world. Well done. As I, James Scott Valentine, take you, Emma Jane Connell, to be my wife, I promise to love and respect you. I will stand by you and be true to you always. Whatever life may bring, I will always love you. As I, Emma Jane Connell, take you, James Scott Valentine, to be my husband. I promise to love you and respect you. I will stand by you and be true to you always. Whatever life may bring, I will always love you. After going together for two years, James managed to pluck up enough courage to visit Emma's father and ask him for her hand in marriage. With John's consent, James decided to propose to Emma in a very romantic location, a Scottish castle, in September 2010. Kneeling in a puddle on that very grey day, James asked Emma for her hand in marriage. And after a few expletives, she said yes. Thank you so much for everyone coming all the way up here in the cold. Thank you all for coming. Everything Emma is today, she has done herself. And so proud of her as I am. You don't know how proud I am of her. We really have such a wonderful team. And it became more apparent we sort of worked together. And, and I know that I've had so many girls today around me, but I can't stress to you enough how wonderful it is to have peace and harmony in people as a team. Sharing just wonderful moments like this together and just being, uh, having, making good memories and just having fun. We do have to say, I mean, you know, a little bit of sentimentalness. Is that a word? <laughs> 
Um, I mean, what a pair. Absolute peas in a pod. I think all of us feel the same way. They're just absolute belters. We love them to bits. It is now with the authority invested in me that I pronounce that you are my husband and wife. Love is a miraculous gift, but it is a pure delight for the rest of us to see how happy two people can be when they're in love. And we are all here to witness, to celebrate, to honor, to dance, to laugh, to sing, to eat, and to do all sorts of things that we do at weddings. This is a fabulous place to be married. And I can think of no better ending to a fairy tale wedding than to say, may you live together happily ever after.